Hello everyone, Justin G. Hill here, and uh, we are back with Queen of Hearts. Uh, I was going to do this album, or start on this album, over the weekend, and I'm kind of glad that I didn't because I saw that a live clip of Queen of Hearts dropped today, so I'm going to be watching that as well. We're going to start with the lyric video so that I can get an idea for the song before I'm visually attacked, which is pretty much what happened with the music video for Talk That Talk. I barely said anything about the actual audio and the, the singing itself. Uh, I thought Suey did a great, great job. I thought she was Jung Yeon in the first pre-chorus. I thought it was Jung Yeon doing that whole pre-chorus, but it was Suey and Jung Yeon. They sounded absolutely phenomenal. Everyone sounded honestly as good or better uh, than what I've ever heard them. I, I think that they sounded amazing. It sounds like they've really matured in their voices, but Sui was the one that probably impressed me the most because it was unexpected to hear the vibrato in her voice in the first uh, pre-chorus and uh, just the way that the way that she performed her parts throughout the song. I thought she did a phenomenal job and it's good to hear Jung Yeon really back in form and comfortable with uh, performing again. Even though she's used to the studio after all these years, she really sounds at ease, really sounds like she's back in her element, and I love it. And and all of the girls, uh, Jihyo, I, I love the way Momo sounded as well. Um, I, I really thought everyone in that song did a phenomenal job. Uh, Dahyun and uh, Cheyoung uh, both uh, switching back and forth, and Momo also between the, the rapping and the singing. I really thought the audio for uh, Talk That Talk was great. I love the rhythm. The drop in the chorus is amazing, but I failed to mention pretty much all of those things because I was so visually attacked during the music video, so I apologize for that and, uh, and for the super quick analysis right now, but we're going to get into Queen of Hearts uh, in just a second, but also I have most of my albums in now. I have three signed versions. I ordered four. One of more is supposed to be here probably tomorrow. And I have two Target albums and I have one more of those on the way as well. I don't know why they all didn't come with the other because I ordered them early enough for them to all, you know, be shipped at the same time. It's not like I ordered something, you know, after the shipping started. So, but I'm missing one signed version. I have four of those uh, that I'm supposed to be getting and I have three Target albums two of which I have so hopefully the uh, other one of each of those is coming tomorrow but anyways uh, and I will be making a video of those as well I don't have any fancy setup I've watched a few unboxing videos mine is going to be very crude it's very possible that I'm just going to open the album and just show you what's in there as I pull things out um, if I can figure out something a little bit more clever that's fine but I don't have a a good uh, overhead view setup like what uh, like what I'm seeing people uh, have in other unboxing videos but anyways we're starting this right now Queen of Hearts we're gonna start with the lyric video I think I heard that this is fully in English I think I saw that in the discord server um, someone found that out like ahead of time and um, whether it is or it isn't I have a lyric video here and then we're going to go to the live clip that was posted today so here we go Okay, okay, okay. Before we get into the pre-chorus, I think, or maybe chorus, um, this was a very unexpected... I, I don't remember. I, I watched the entire album preview, and I'll probably say this in every video. I watched the entire album preview, but I really don't remember much about these other beats. I was focusing on Talk That Talk so much and trying to kind of figure out uh, how the melody was going to sound for that. I really don't remember these other ones very much. But I did not expect such a stripped back sound to start. Uh, this is surprising me. So I want to see what the drop sounds like. I think Momo was coming in with the pre-chorus just now. Uh, we're going to start it over again. Sorry for, you know, rewinding and such. But I really want to take my time with these and get them right. 
Uh, I don't have, again, the visual attack uh, just, you know, completely blinding me to anything else that's going on. So we can get a, a nice full effect here. I do like the uh, the bassy sound uh, starting out, but it's, it's so stripped back right now. I want to see what the drop sounds like in the chorus. Uh, but this has surprised me so far. I didn't expect this. Still, still love what Suey's doing. She sounds phenomenal. She sounds like she's improved so much. We're going back to the beginning of the chorus on that. Uh, I liked the drop. It might be because I've got my audio so much lower now. I'm trying to get more of a balance so that I can be heard well enough when I'm doing these reactions. Uh, I had it way too high during my initial first premiere, world premiere reaction of the Talk That Talk music video. So I've got it pulled back a lot now. But I wish this had a little bit more bass a little bit more oomph to the sound when the chorus comes in, but I like what I'm hearing. I really like what I'm hearing here, and um, and I, I, I love G Hill's high notes, and of course G Hill's the queen. Of course she is. Uh, of course she would get that line, but we're gonna go back to that chorus again. Yeah. I cannot wait to see this live performance now. I don't know if they're going to clearly be doing it live or if it's just like a performance clip. I'm assuming they do it live. They're not they're not shy about doing live vocals at all. Um, but I love the high notes that Nyon and and, uh, and Jikyo were hitting there. Uh, and it, it it sounds it sounds stronger the second time around. I probably need to get some good speakers and things like that. And then this probably would hit pretty well. Uh, but I, I like what I'm hearing so far, and uh, we're going to go back to the end of the, the chorus there, and then we'll get into Mina starting the second verse. All right, we're going back to the second verse because I did not. I like I like the way Mina divided up. Her, her wording, she was, pa, 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 pa. you know, I, I don't have the rhythm right. I know I don't have it that correct right now. But, and then Che Young came in just speeding through those lines. Her flow is fantastic. I love the way she sounds there. And uh, and then I loved having Jung Young come in on the, the second chorus with those power notes. I think, I pretty much think three mix, uh, Nyon, Jung Young, and Ji Hyo should basically do all of the choruses and let the others um, bring their uh, their wonderful styles and varied styles into the verses and the bridges. 
let these girls handle the power because they just bring it every single time. Not that the other ones don't have great voices. I love all nine of these girls' voices. I really do. But it's just Nyan Jung Yon and Jikyo just they just hammer when they when they hit these belts. And um, and they're hitting the they're they're hitting the the head voice the, the falsetto as well in this. I I really like what I'm hearing from from them. But uh, we're gonna go back to the second verse and let these girls spit. I I, I love I love the flow from Cheyu. And I was wondering when Sana was coming in. I hadn't heard anything from her yet. Also, I really like the, the the way that the chorus, when the drop hits at first, it's it's really it just hammers in like I said before, and then it hits that double time on the second part of the chorus. I like the uh, I like the uh, the differences there, the variation uh, within the same chorus. I think that that's uh, I, I I really like that. I don't hear that very often, so I, I like the uh, I like the differences in the sound and the rhythm there. So let's go, Sana. Let's just be honest. Tiki already runs the whole universe. She already runs the whole universe. It's just how it is. She she already does. So. So I like that very much. I, I, I like, again, I was surprised by how stripped back it was to start. I probably would have liked a little bit more melody in the beginning of it. Uh, I like the song overall, but probably a little bit more melody besides just the bass and the drums in the first verse. Um, I would have probably liked a more pre-chorus sound um, to start. And then just a little bit more of a build uh, with the pre-chorus, maybe just in the vocals. Maybe maybe start with the the pre-chorus. Let me hear. Let me hear the pre-chorus again. I'm sorry. Uh, it's right here. Yeah. See, we've got. Uh, it sounds like it sounds like more strings coming in. Maybe keys there. It might, it might be keys uh, coming in. Uh, in addition to the bass on the pre-chorus. I would have liked the first verse to start off with this sound, the pre-chorus sound, and then maybe let the vocals and maybe some backup vocals even or some ad-libs or, ad or some harmonizing 
come in on the pre-chorus and then have that drop. I just I just wanted a little bit more starting out. I, it, it being so stripped back, so minimal to start, it kind of took me a minute to get into the song, but the vocals are phenomenal. I'll admit, I don't know that they're going to hit all of these live. I hope they do. I would love it if they did. I know they're capable. I know they're capable. Uh, so I am I am looking forward to this. But I like the song overall. I would have liked a little bit more Sana and Dahyun. I think we didn't quite get enough of those two. I'm I'm curious a little bit to see like a line distribution video to see who who got the most. I'm sure Nayeon and, and Jihyo probably got the most. Jungyeon did quite a bit as well. Um, but I'm I, I, I think Sana and Sana and Dahyun kind of got kind of got set in the back on this. But they did their parts. They did them well. Um, but I, I guess I guess on B sides, I'm looking for more of an even line distribution. Um, because they're 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 not as popular, you know. You can you can do a lot of different things, um, but anyways, I, I I like the song. I like it overall. Uh, next, we're going to get into the live clip here. Let's see how this goes. I can hear what in the world what are you doing I can I can hear live vocals sorry about that I can hear live vocals but I also think that they have layering uh, going on here for sure uh, it sounds like Che Young is actually completely live but I don't think everyone has that um, but I, I like the way that they switched up it almost looks like one of the uh, one of those like um, like like just a band having practice the way that the way that everybody came in in the group shot in the in the chorus uh, after Nyon's part whenever it switched over to Jihyo. Um but I of course the visuals are just unbelievable I like the style of the video I like the style a lot it's again kind of kind of a stripped back style kind of a laid back they're all casual looking phenomenal but they're they're just in casual outfits I really like this. Young Yan. Oh, 
Oh, by the way, the guy out in glasses. That was really fun. I really liked that. That was that was enjoyable. I, I love like like I said the stripped back setting, the uh, the just casual, and yet they look absolutely phenomenal. We need to talk about Mina's hair. Why doesn't she have this hair now? She did this with the talk that talk choreography video, which by the way I think is absolutely phenomenal. Uh, but anyways, that 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 hair. Wow, I love those purple streaks. Um, they did they did a great job here i i loved how they brought the energy i need to see this live i want to hear that drop that chorus drop live very very badly i cannot wait until they go on tour again i will absolutely positively be there without question uh this i, I really like this this was this was this was very nice um queen of hearts definitely going on the playlist uh, I I enjoyed this thoroughly. I really want to hear it. Like I said, I need to get I need to get better better speakers, a better sound system, headphones, things like that. I am definitely going to be listening to this very soon with with a little bit higher quality audio. Um, but uh, for now, this is this is what I have. But uh, thank you for joining me. Sorry uh, for the the longer video, but I wanted to go more in depth this time. And uh, feel free to like, comment, and yeah, subscribe. Excuse me. Um, please watch the original videos. Stream the original videos. Support the girls. Um, they deserve it. They work very hard for us onces. And um, yeah, I will come back later this week, maybe tomorrow, uh, with album unboxings and uh, more of the album, more of the Between 1 and 2 album. So thank you, everyone. Have a great day.